Welcome back to the video library. Today we're going to be going over a small checklist of items to make sure you're ready to go for the upcoming season. First we're going to be discussing seasons, then we're going to check our templates, and then we're going to make sure our calendar is all set up for the upcoming year. For seasons, we're going to navigate to Starter Hut, the Admin section, and then Pricing. In here, at the bottom of the list, we'll find our season. To view a season, we can see it here. To edit our season, we can simply click on the season we need to adjust. As we can see here, we need to add our 2022 year. If the season is comprised of the same date range, all we need to do is simply click on the latest dates and hit Add Next Year. That'll add your next year for this specific season in which spring is the one we're at. After we hit save, it'll update our booking. If we hit yes, and we're good to go for the 2020, 2022 year for spring. We then just simply need to go into summer and fall and adjust those dates accordingly. That's how we view, edit, and adjust our seasons. For our templates, we need to go into Setup, TC Template Setup, and as, as we can see here, we have a lot of templates that we've set up over the past years. To make sure our template that we want to use for the spring or various dates throughout the year are appropriate, we just simply find the template we need to look at, double click to go into it, and then just verify everything is good. As you can see here, we have an 18 hole morning template set up here. Template type is regular. First tea time starts at 8, and the last tea time is 1700 using an 8 minute intervals. If any of this information needs to change, just simply edit it here before we apply it to our tea sheet. As you can see here down at the bottom, we also have what dates this template is available for. You can set this in the template itself, but we can also set it when we apply it. Now, if we're ready to apply, we jump back over to the tea sheet. A day that does not have a template attached to it to a course will look like this. To apply a template, for example, the 18 hole morning template we just looked at, we can just simply double click it. That will apply it for the date range that we see down below. So if I double clicked it right in this instance, it would apply from 38 to 38. So today. If we need to adjust it for a date range, so let's say I wanted to apply this for the entire month of March. Change this end date to be the end date you needed to. And then below, since the template setup had all dates available, we can either leave that checked here if we want it Monday through Sunday. Or let's say we just needed it Monday through Friday. We can unselect these two here. And then when we double click this template, this template will be applied for this date range for these days. That's how we apply templates. Lastly, we're going to be discussing the calendar section. The calendar section lives under the admin section of the starter hut, admin, and then calendar. What the calendar essentially does is it tells the system what you consider the weekend, but we're not going to be bothering with that. Ultimately, we're going to be checking to make sure our holidays are set up appropriately for the upcoming year. What a holiday is in our system will be anything in this list for your specific site, in which case the rates will use the holiday section for your rate. So to make sure these are correct, we just need to find our site. In this case, we're going to be using all sites and then making sure that the below list is what's going to be a, a holiday for your specific location. To adjust these, take them out or edit them, all we need to do is for example, click on the one we need to look at, hit edit. If we need to change the date, for example, we can do it here by this drop down, change the description, or if we need to take it away, we can just simply hit delete. If the series of holidays works for other locations, we can use the clone button and then paste it into the appropriate other locations. Just to review, 
these holidays will trigger the holiday rates in your holiday setup. This has been an overview of a few items to check before your season ramps up.